Yo koso! Japanese Quest away. Welcome to Japanese Quest. Today, the journey continues. What we do here, we learn Japanese from Japanese games. I'm a Japanese teacher. My name is Akira Sensei, so welcome everyone. Today, the journey continues in Dragon Quest 11. You can see words at the bottom we've already learned, words at the top we're adding to. We'll find new words today. Our power level will go up. Let's go. Welcome everyone. Let's run around. I feel like... You can see the title. The title is to make a new goal. Uh, go to the Discord, make that goal. If someone wants to link the Discord, do that. Uh, the key with the goal is to make it specific. But we were having a bit of a discussion just now in the Discord, and I, I'm now feeling I want to try to compose the perfect tweet. Because, uh, Kali and Kanji, you can see, was the first comment there, was talking about the word for humming in Japanese. And I feel like I need to make a tweet about this in the Japanese Quest Twitter account. Uh... It's just fate that this happened that I feel like I need to do this. I feel like we can make a viral tweet, potentially, and in doing so, teach a new word. So exactly, that's the word. Knows song. I think I must make a tweet about it. So let's go to the browser cam. Let's look at our Twitter and review. Just made a tweet, by the way. Ooh, some people like it, apparently. We got some bells. Um, so here's the new tweet. Let's see. So new quest today for our summer reading club. New quest today, make a goal, make it specific. What is your Japanese reading goal this summer? You can say what it is in chat. You can go to the Discord, say it there. You can go to Twitter and say it here. You can respond to this. If you want to like this, let's like it. Let's retweet it. Let's spread it around so uh, we can spread around this uh, summer reading club. Um, some examples of specific goals. Read at least 15 minutes every day. Read five manga. Finish first light novel, complete first video game in Japanese. These are all good examples of specific goals, and if you want to reply, just respond to this and uh, make your goal, or just say it. You can say it in comments right now on chat, you can say it on Discord. It's up to you. You can say it in your heart, that works too. So, my goal number one, read at least five manga. Number two, read at least five books. Can read more, but at least five for this summer. That's my goal. And number three, and this is relevant to what we're doing right now, uh, beat Dragon Quest XI in Japanese, teaching Japanese in context and talking about reading as we go, and that's what we're doing right now. Um, now it's time to do number three. Let's, uh, yeah, let's work on beating Dragon Quest. Uh, we got some bells, let's see. Ooh, people are retweeting this. Sweet, keep those retweets, keep those likes coming. Let's spread around the power of reading throughout the internet. Um, looking good, looking good. But I think now... I've, I just got to make a tweet. I didn't think we would, but I think we have to. Let's together try to make the perfect tweet. Okay. So, this is the tweet. Uh, composing the perfect tweet. How does it work? So again, let's see those words. The word for humming in Japanese. What is it? Hana uta. Again, you can link our Twitter page, our Twitch page in the chat too, so you can kind of see what we're doing. Hana uta. And I like that word. I've heard it before, but wasn't that familiar with it. Didn't really think about it ever too much. Basically, it's the kanji for nose, hana, plus the kanji for song. Uta, song. Okay, so humming, hana uta. So let's just say. The word for humming in Japanese I can't type properly but you get the idea is hana uta and let's uh, let's even put that in maybe romaji so everyone can read it. 
Actually, we kind of need Kana too, don't we? Hana Futa. Hana Futa. The word for humming in Japanese is Hana Uta, meaning no song. Okay, I feel like that's a bit too much going on with that line, but you get the idea. And so, why... Is humming called nose song? In Japanese. The reason I feel like I have to tweet this is because I feel like it's like the perfect mnemonic. It's like a deeply physical mnemonic. And now you can try this. Just try... Try humming... with your nose closed. So just try it. You'll get a very good mnemonic, a physical, deep physical mnemonic of why it's called nose song. So the word for humming in Japanese is hana uta. Uh, I feel like we actually might want this nose song first just to make this readable to as many English speakers as possible. The word for humming in Japanese is no song, hana uta. Does that make sense, you think? The word for humming in Japanese is no song. I feel like we want something there. I'm gonna go back to chat, we can go back to the game for a minute. We're trying to make the first, tw first tweet, we can, we can bit, take a bit longer on it. Let's go back. Yeah, no song. Crooning, yeah, crooning. To me, it's like an old-timing kind of, old-timey kind of singing, I don't know. Uh, Bolshimika. Yokoso, Japanese Kostoe. You can challenge people to try humming with their nose closed. Yeah, exactly, that's what I was thinking. That's like the perfect demonic is kind of to challenge them to do that. Change what to why in the second sentence. Okay, did I do it? A typo there? Let's go back. Ah, uh, yeah, what? Why did I put that? That's not going to be a good tweet. So, why is humming called no song in Japanese? How about this? Just try humming with your nose closed. I feel like... The last line must be more perfected. Try humming with your nose closed. So the word for humming in Japanese is Hana uta. Hana uta. No song. I don't know, I'm, I'm actually maybe thinking I want to go with Romaji with that, possibly. Just so everyone who can read English can just read it easily and then just show the Japanese. Hana Uta. You think that works? I think that kind of works. But in a way, you want Kana then. Maybe just do Kana. It's so tricky. When you're making a, a tweet that's for all languages, it's very tricky. To make it properly calibrated. So the word for humming in Japanese is hana uta. No song. But then people can't read how to say it. But maybe that doesn't matter. I don't know, what do you think? Let's go back to the game. Sometimes when you just give something a minute, you can come back with, it with fresh eyes. Uh, keep the kanji for sure, I think that works. 
I think Romaji should be in there for people who aren't studying Japanese, but yeah, might still find the tweet interesting. Yeah, it's, it's hard to know how to exactly calibrate that. We can we can work on that a bit later, maybe. Anyway, what we normally do, we learn Japanese from Japanese games. We're doing that today. Um, also, today we have this new quest. Make a goal. Make it specific. What is your reading goal this summer? We have a Japanese reading club this summer in Japanese quest. So what is your reading goal this summer? Ah, nice. That Uta song is covered in Genki 1. So yeah, a lot of people know that. Good to know. Pokemon. Um, good comment. Um, let's check our Discord, too. So let's check the Discord here. So here's the Summer Reading Club. Check it out. Link to the Discord. You can find it. Um, so today... Quest 3. New quest. They're all pinned if you want to navigate. You can navigate the pins. Quest 1, 2, 3. Quest 1 was find a thing to read in Japanese. Quest 2. Read Japanese every day this summer. That's kind of the overall goal. And then, quest 3 today, make a goal, make it specific. What is your Japanese reading goal this summer? So now is the time uh, to write that, you can write that in the Discord, so what is your goal? So far, it looks like we have one person wrote their goal, I wrote my goal. Again, read Japanese, read 5 manga, read 5 books, beat Dragon Quest XI in Japanese, that's all of us together. And then, uh, Ochel wrote, you can't see it on this screen, but get the full series, or got the full series from eBay last year. Uh, I think they're responding to someone else. So write your goal here. You can complete the quest here. Um, write your goal. Let's go back to the game. What does the scouter say about his power level? Power level is rising right now. Yeah, let's review. What is our power level? How many words have we learned? We are up to 3,158. Right down here. Power level today will go up as we find new words, but I think we need to finish that tweet. I think we do. Let's go back to that tweet. Let's finish it. Um, this tweet that hopefully everyone in the world on Twitter, it can be so powerful. That's the goal, that everyone can learn at least one word today. Actually, three words. Hana knows. Uta song and Hana Uta humming. The goal is to make everyone on Twitter learn three words today. And today we must make this perfect tweet. Let's try. Let's go back to it. Okay. The word for humming in Japanese is Hana Uta. Yeah, if this is going to apply to everyone on Twitter, we need... I think we need Romaji. Hana Uta. And I think you kind of need that space there just to see they're separated. Hana Uta. The word for humming in Japanese is Hana Uta. No song. So why is humming called no song in Japanese? We don't need all these quotes everywhere. But I think you kind of do it, need it for no song, don't you? Because it's so kind of strange. <sighs> Maybe an exclamation point. So try humming with your nose closed. Do you think, what do you think of the status of this tweet? Does it look pretty good right now? So the word for humming in Japanese is hana uta, no song. Why is humming called no song in Japanese? Try humming with your nose closed. So I just feel like this is a pretty powerful mnemonic. That's why we're doing it. Um, what do you think? Let's go back to the game, see how people are liking that. What does the say about his power level? I wonder if we should ha have a question at the end to engage the audience, like what word exists in another language that changed the way of thinking about something? Yeah, that would be a different tweet if we did that. But yeah, you gotta keep it kind of short for Twitter. It wouldn't even fit with the character limit. Um, but yeah, I think it's kind of good in the current form, but you could do a follow-up tweet. I hummed with, but I think in a way without the follow-up tweet, it might be stronger for like a, people sharing it. Sometimes I think one tweet is stronger. Um, I hummed with my nose closed, got some weird beatboxing noises. Yeah, weird things can happen, but clearly you can hum much better, uh, when you're not closing your nose. Let me just give you an example. 
Here's the Jurassic Park song humming without my nose closed. Let's not interfere with the music. Here we go. Beautiful humming, right? My nose is open. It's a nose song. Hana uta. Makes sense. Let me try humming that same song with my nose closed. Yeah, it doesn't work as well. It really doesn't work as well. It's a nose song. Let's be honest. It's a nose song. I couldn't do it with my nose closed. Um, I tried. I tried my best. Couldn't do it. Uh, let's go back to the game. Please don't update my system. So yeah, it's a no song. That much is clear. What we want is to try to get everyone on Twitter to, to do that no song, because I think that's the strength of this tweet. Try humming with your nose closed. That's like that's like the what's what's it called? The kind of a uh, the climax. I don't know. The turn. Um, the true power of this tweet. Let's go back. So the word for humming in Japanese is hana uta, nose song. Why is humming called nose song in Japanese? Try humming with your nose closed. So I think we might need just, just try humming with your nose closed. English is such a tricky language, so we're working in English. I don't even know what to do in English to make things perfect. Just try humming with your nose closed. So the word for humming in Japanese is hana uta, nose song. So I feel like this part here, I do want the kanji somewhere, but I'm not sure if that's... It's kind of weird to be like, romaji, nose song, hana uta. Maybe put that before. Maybe. But then it's getting too long again. The word for hopping in Japanese is Hana Uta. Yeah, see, now I feel like if we're going astray again. We're getting more bells. I think people like that other tweet we made. That's good. So, what does the scouter say about his power level? Yeah, blowing your nose. That's right. Hana o Kamu. Konnichiwa. Good to see you. Yeah, I think it's time to finish this tweet. Sometimes, if a tweet can't be perfect, just do it. The word for humming in Japanese is Hana Uta. Meaning, nose song. Why is humming called nose song in Japanese? Just try humming with your nose closed. I think that's pretty good, actually. The word for humming in Japanese is hana uta. Literally meaning, meaning nose song. So we got nose, we got song. So the word for humming in Japanese is hana uta, meaning no song. Why is humming called no song in Japanese? Just try humming with your nose closed. Okay, now is the time. I think we're going to tweet it. May not be perfect, but that's okay. Uh, what we need is everyone to retweet and like this tweet, because if we do, possibly everyone in the world can learn not just one word, not just two word, but three words. With the power of this visceral humming with your nose closed. I think most people in the world have not done this action. They just haven't really done the action. Have you done it? It's a, it's a weird feeling. So let's tweet that. Do the weird feeling, because I think with this weird feeling, everyone in on Twitch, everyone in the world um, who's on Twitch, and then they'll spread it to everyone else in the world. Everyone in the world can learn three words. Hana, nose, uta, song, and humming in Japanese, nose song. So let's tweet this. Everyone needs to retweet it and uh, like it, because this... 
Everyone in the world can learn Japanese today. Let's tweet it. We got some bells. That's good. And now let's find that tweet. We must like it. We must retweet it. So the someone retweeted it. Thank you. Uh, the word for humming in Japanese means hana uta. Is hana uta meaning no song? Why is humming called no song in Japanese? Just try humming with your nose closed. Yep, we got some retweets. We got some likes. So this is a powerful mnemonic. Just try it. It's freaking weird, man. <laughs> you can learn all these three words easily with just this weird action that no one should ever do. But if you do it, you unlock these three words. Hana, uta. Hana, uta. No song. We got some likes. We got some retweets. And uh, yeah, let's see throughout the stream how high this can get. Right now we're at 9 likes, 7 retweets. I'm guessing that's probably almost purely with people who are watching live. Um, let's see how high we can get this thing. We got some retweets. It's going. Let's do it. I appreciate the retweets. Let's go. Because I feel like the strength of this tweet... Normally we have things that are just like for kind of Japanese learners, but this is kind of interesting for everyone. Because that's so weird. Like, no song? Why is that no song? Ah. Just try humming with your nose closed. You will understand. Um, if you haven't tried it yet, try it. Again, here's the song for... Uh, the theme song. So that's normal humming. But now with my nose closed... Can't do it. Just can't do it. That's why. Just try humming with your nose closed. You will learn. You will learn the truth. And by the way, Hana again means nose, Uta means song for everyone who's here. Together, Hana Uta, humming. And by the way, Kelly and Kanji, thank you so much for uh, letting us know about this uh, word today so we could do this tweet. We'll see how far it can go, and thanks for the retweet for it. So retweet it, keep it going. It sounds like I'm about to cry. See, people like it. This person's probably not even watching our stream. They're not even following us. See? It's powerful. It's spreading. It's spreading beyond. We're getting comments on it. Sounds like I'm about to cry. See, we're giving people new life experiences here. This could seriously go... Like, I honestly think this could go to, like, a thousand retweets, potentially. I'm not saying it, it will, but I think it's got the potential. It's got a weird potential, this tweet. Which is why we try to do the perfect tweet here. Um, will it get there? Probably not, but we'll see by the end of stream where we'll get right now. 13 likes, it kind of slowed down. So yeah, maybe I'm wrong, but anyway. You never know. So back to the game. Oh uh, yeah, that person follows me. Yeah, I bet they did. Um, yeah, it feels impossible to do with your nose closed. Very true. Noseless people are raging. Yep, it will be a raging loop, by the way. That's a very good visual novel. Yokoso, Japanese Coste. Welcome, by the way, when I'm just joining. Uh, we don't just write tweets here. Uh... I'm a Japanese teacher, but we do here. We learn Japanese through Japanese games, but sometimes we must try to do a perfect tweet for, so everyone in the world can learn Japanese today. Uh, actually, that's the first time we really did that on stream. But uh, yeah, kind of fun, because you never know. You can check in throughout stream, see how high that gets. Right now is at, what, like 13 likes, 9 retweets? That's not bad for a start in like 5 minutes. Okay, so where are we? We are on a rock. The journey continues in Dragon Quest XI. We can find new words in the game. Our power level will, will go up. Um, I think there's one word we should probably add, though. Anyone can think of the word we should add right now to our power level? A clip of your nose song. Yeah, thanks for that. <laughs> All right, so I think we need to add... Everyone, the perfect tweet doesn't exist. Have you tried humming with your nose closed? Exactly. It's just... It's it's very rare that you can make a tweet that could make someone immediately tr try something that they've never done in their life before that can also teach them a word or three words. So I felt like we had to do that tweet. It's just, it's too powerful as a mnemonic, as a sensory experience learning situation. So yeah, I think we need to level up. 
check it out. Let's go to our power-up screen. What we do here, we sometimes look up words. Anyone can add new words. But uh, today, what word are we adding first? I think you all know. Wani Kani level 17. Anyone got to that level yet? I know some people here do Wani Kani. So, Hana Uta. Humming. No song. We just tweeted about it. We gotta, we gotta learn it. And if it's green, I'm gonna get angry, because that means it's a duplicate. There's no way we learned this already. Let's just see. Good. New word. Humming. We've powered up now with the power of humming. No song. I guarantee you the uh, individual words we've learned. Just let's, let's make 100% sure. So Hana knows. Yep, we've learned that. What about Uta? Song. Ooh, you're still level 11? Cool, so you're almost at the power of humming. So, yep, we've learned that turn green means it's a duplicate. Good. We've now powered up with the power of humming. No song. Hana uta. Power level has gone up. And let's check the power level. Has the power level of our, of our tweet gone up at all yet? Let's see. The power level of our tweet. Again, let's go to our profile. How does one go to their profile? Oh yeah, click on that. So let's see. Ooh! 17 likes, it has gone up. Up to 11 retweets. So it does seem this tweet has some power. Probably not getting to 1,000 retweets at this rate, I'm guessing. But if you think about it, 6 minutes, already almost double that in likes and retweets. Yeah, the potential is there. The potential is definitely there. If we get retweeted by some big people in the Japanese learning community, yeah, this one could go far, because the ratio that I normally look at, if it gets like, a, on my channel at least, like a like a minute, or a retweet a minute, is usually pretty good. I know it's kind of biased, because people have retweeted off of the live stream, but still, I think there's potential. We'll see. Let's look at all our notifications. People dig it. Kelly replied. We like that tweet. Sweet. Let's go back to the game. Keep it on our profile, we can check in on that. 18 likes, 11 retweets for our attempt at the perfect tweet. And it really boils down to this. Just try humming with your nose closed. Hana uta. Humming. Okay, let's go back to the game. What does the scouter say about his power level? Power level is rising, and uh, also we're leveling up in the game right now. We're leveling up in Japanese as well. We're putting crabs to sleep. We're doing a lot today on Japanese Quest. The cat is back. Say hello to Griffin Sensei. The first ever party member on Japanese Quest. By the way, if anyone wants to follow, you can become a party member as well and join us on this journey, join us on this quest. Learning Japanese from Japanese games, that's what we do. Alright, so where are we now? We're on a field. Let's re Ooh, I kind of like this. Look at this. The moon. Is that the moon? Or is that the sun? No, that's the sun, isn't it? The sun is rising. Anyone know the word for a sunrise in Japanese? It's also a name for a popular beer in Japan. Anyone know it? Eat us nah. Let's see in chat if anyone knows it. The word for sunrise. Also popular beer. Yep, I think we've got it. Do we have that word learned yet? Let's go to the dictionary and see if we have that word learned. This sunrise is so beautiful. I think we might need to learn that word if we haven't yet. So asa is morning. He is sun. So morning sun. Asahi. Morning sun. Kelly and Kanji, I know my beer. Morning sun. Looks good. So I guess sunrise might be more. Ooh, Japanese journeyman rating us with a party of four. Yokoso. Japanese custom By the way, I saw your uh, post in our Discord. 
Thanks for making the post in our Discord, because uh, your stream is awesome. So everyone, let's do a shout-out for uh, Japanese Journeyman. When I saw it, at least, it was uh, actually two people streaming, which is unique in the Japanese learning slash teaching space. They both seem to be saying they're around N2 level, playing Tales of... was it? One of the ta Tales of games in Japanese. What game are you playing? So shout out, check them out, follow them. Let's everyone follow Japanese Journeymen because they're an awesome Japanese teacher slash learner just like this channel and they're also in our Discord which means they are awesome. Except for that person that bot we banned yesterday. Everyone in our Discord is awesome right now. So uh, yeah, check them out, follow them. Kelly and Kanji, check Kelly and Kanji out too. Also awesome. Is there a different difference between sunrise, sun up, or daybreak in Japanese? I don't even know the difference in English, to be honest. Um, language is weird. But yeah. Hinode, sunrise. Um, asahi, morning sun. Um, let's add both of these for fun. Because such a good sunrise. So we have learned that turn green. Let's see the other one. Asahi, Morning Sun. So we've learned both. They both turn green. Um, that's good. We can delete them, though. All right, back to the game. What does the scouter say about his power level? What does the scouter say about our power level? Power level is going up with the power of... Nose song. Humming. Hana uta. Hana means nose. Uta means song. Put them together. Nose song. And uh, let's see the game, too. Okay, so here's our adventure guide. You can see what we're doing in the game. Bulken Guide, adventure guide. Bulken means adventure. Okay, this first thing we already did, we found this ore, Koseki, in this uh, floating island in the sky, this ancient battlefield, so we did that. I think the next one we wanna do is the middle thing. This is all to make the kind of hero sword. So, Samadhi de. So, in this land of Samadhi in Katiana here, uh, Hamma o Te ni ire. So, we have to get the hammer. That's the key. Let's find the hammer. By the way, have we learned the word for hammer in Japanese? Because we could add this to our power level. The word for hammer in Katakana, that's what we need today. So, the word for hammer, I doubt we have it. We could add that word if someone wants to add that word. Let's power up with the power of this hammer we're looking for in the game. Okay, and so where is that hammer? Let's find it. Ooh, check it out. There's even a hammer emote. That I did not know. I can level up my emote knowledge as well. We can level up in many ways on Japanese Quest. In Japanese, in the game, in emote knowledge, in tweet knowledge, all of it. Okay, let's teleport. I know it started with a saw. Where's a saw? Didn't it start with a saw? Eh, I thought it started with a saw, didn't it? Yeah, there we go. Samari Chiho. This is the one. It starts with a saw. Saw. Ikimashou. Kosoko? Anyone who's watched a... Uh, anyone watched a lot of a... Uh, what's that show on Netflix? Terrace House? Do you know this reference? Kosoko? Minade? Kosoko? Highly recommend that show, by the way. Great listening practice, Terrace House. Do <laughs> Whenever I see a Costco or I hear someone say Costco, I think of that scene in that show for some reason. Costco? <laughs> it's like the best scene at the cost Costco incident. Yeah, Terrace House is an amazing show. It's, um, and I really like that season where they talk about Costco? Minade? It's hard to explain even what happened, but just check out Terrace House. I think, what was the one? 
with the Costa Close scene. It was like the terrace house, like kids in the city or something like that. Yeah, it was like this this guy, this guy who's like the tap dancing guy. He's like a really good tap dancer, but like kind of a nerdy guy beyond his extreme tap dancing ability. He uh, kind of asked this girl out to go to Costco. <laughs> but she really didn't want to go out with him, it seemed like. And so her response was... No, actually, he asked to go to a different place, didn't he? But then she, like, changed the idea and was like, Oh, Costco? How about we go to Costco with, like, everyone? The Minade meaning everyone. And so she kind of shot him down with using Costco? Minade? It's hard to explain. But yeah, find the clip. Link to it. You can find it. Um... I might have to click on this clip. Let's see if I can find it. I think if we watch like a really short clip, if you found a really short clip... Costco? <laughs> okay, yeah, so this this guy is kind of like asking her out on a driving date and uh, I'm gonna play it just a real quick clip if we if we just do a quick clip I think we'll be okay copyright wise hopefully thank you Netflix for not glitching us um Okay, so here we go. This is the scene. This is the tap dance guy and he kind of asks her out. Let's kind of see it um here we go. Let's turn off the music from the game for now. So he's saying I want to go out driving with you, basically. So he's like, Noro. <laughs> like, let's ride it. Let's ride it together. And she's like, Kuruma? Like, what? <laughs> and then she says, but but everyone was, was saying they want to go to Costco. And now he's like, what, Costco? <laughs> so now he's like, I was asking you on a date, and now let's. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was about Costco. Um, just look, we got to see that moment again, one more time. <laughs> コストコ。コストコ。コストコ。コストコ。yeah not the reaction of someone who probably wants to go but anyway um costco. yeah recommend the show terrace house um so yeah if you ever go to costco maybe now you'll always think of that uh like i do back to the game hopefully we'll not get copyright stricken for that brief moment but uh anyway it's a reason to get netflix so it's kind of an ad for netflix uh we do not own the copyright to all of netflix just so everyone knows um, so back to the game. But yeah, Costa Code does sound good though. Um, let's see. So what is going on here? Eh? Jumped right into a scene? What happened here? I think I got distracted by Costa Code and now what is happening? Eh? Ah, it must be a thing where like we have to like deal with their problem here probably. So Yusha no Hoshi, the star of the hero. Hoshi is star. So the star of the hero is now here and it seems to be this rumor that is growing closer and closer to this city seems true. Take a look, everything's kind of red. I feel like now General Greg, I feel like now he's he kind of wants to go to Kostoko. What do you think?
大樹が地に落ち世界が闇に包まれた後突如として落下を始めたそうだ一体世界で何が起こっているのか Okay, so the world tree fell to the earth. The world was covered in darkness.、Um, and then suddenly, this star started falling. What in the world is happening in the world? <laughs> That's some weird English.、Um, so, Sekaide in the world. Nariga okotteru. What is happening in the world? Yeah, link to free greater readers. That sounds good. Greater readers are very good to get started reading.、Uh, by the way, there are great tools too for kind of reading on Netflix. We talked about Netflix. You can watch Terrace House, for example, with Japanese subtitles. And there's, there's an add, add on you can add to Netflix to also have English, Japanese at the same time. You can hover over the Japanese. You can look up those words with a dictionary. Very useful extension. What's it called again? I. I did a tweet about that before, and that one I think got over a thousand retweets because that is just a very, very useful tool. It's a kind of game changer for learning Japanese from Netflix, reading as you go. Yeah, I think that's it. Language learning with Netflix. I should probably retweet that again sometime because it's a very, very useful tool.、Um, speaking of Twitter, let's go back and see how that tweet is doing. We got six bells, so it's been doing something. Up to 21 likes, 12 retweets. Pretty good, pretty good. But now it's up to likes per minute, so it has been slowing down the, the, the likes per minute's rate. So、uh, we'll see how high it gets. 21 likes now, 12 retweets. Again, we're spreading this tweet around the world so everyone can learn three words Hana, nose, uta, song, put them together. Hana, uta, humming. And、uh, why is humming called no song in Japanese? Just try humming with your nose closed. Try it. Just try it, I dare you. So these bells, people like it. People like it. Spread it around. Let's get everyone on Twitter to learn some Japanese today. Let's go back to the game. What does the scouter say about his power level? I've heard the key for blind dates is within the first 15 minutes, bring up Hana Uta, no song. That's the key. I don't know. Just what I've heard. All right, so back to the game. Oh, nice. Yeah, language learning with Netflix. Very good tool. <laughs> yeah, they may have gone differently.、Um, maybe not in a good way, but you never know. Did you know about Noah's song?、Um, we can share this experience that you've never had before. Suddenly you'll be bonded in a, a very deep Noah's song kind of way. Okay.、Um, so, what in the world is happening in the world? This star is falling. <laughs> Nani? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I would, I would、uh, recommend No Song over this one because No Song is. Everyone can understand No Song. Those who are following Japanese on Quest on Twitch, it's an elite group of 6,000 individuals. And rising. Almost 6,000, anyway. Um, what are we at? Like 5,976, something like that, current party members on Twitch. But if you add them all up on Twitter and YouTube, it is over 10,000 right now combined. So that's cool. So, Yusha no Hoshi ka. Ah, the star of the hero. Again, Hoshi means star. I keep wanting to see characters now try the nose song, humming with their nose closed now. Yugu no Ania, Roshu Samanga Jashin will Tawista to 
ロトゼタシアを永遠に見守るため天に昇り勇者の星になったという神話がある。えぇ、so、神話がある。What kind of myth is it? It's modified by everything that came before. So we have some kind of myth.、Um, the myth of Ten ni no Bori to going up into the sky.、Uh, Yusha no Hoshi ni natta became the star of the hero. So who did that now? So someone went in the sky, became this star. Who was it?、Uh, of course, it was the legendary hero, Roshu sama. So once he defeated the evil god. Um, to watch over the world forever. A N N E. A N N E. Forever, that means.、Um, this legend. Where is the legend? In the first part here. Yugo no Aniwa. In the kingdom that this guy is from. He is the king there. And that's the legend. So, yeah, kind of a lot happening in the sentence. But the main thing there's a myth. Shinwa. And、uh, this guy, this legendary hero. Became the hero star, Yusha no Hoshi. And the fun of Japanese is kind of just getting used to the order of these words. Often there's key info at the end,、um, key on info at the beginning, and it, it's challenging to kind of parse where all that key on info is.、Um, it can kind of start, sometimes help to start at the end and work back, but normally, of course, when you're reading, you can, you can kind of. Build forward with the new information. All right. Ooh, you have a goal for the reading quest. What's your goal? What's your goal? Let's hear it. In fact, what's everyone's goal? What is everyone's goal? Because today you can see the title. The quest today, make a goal. What is your goal? Make it specific.、Uh, what is your goal for reading Japanese this summer? We've got this reading. Club this summer,、um, Japanese Reading Club. Check out the Discord if you want to see more about it. But、uh, we can see here too. What is your goal? My goal? Read five manga, read five books, of course, all in Japanese, and、uh, also beat this game, Dragon Quest XI, in Japanese and teach Japanese through it like we're doing right now. So, start some of the greater readers linked by Kelly and Kanji. Awesome goal. Awesome goal. My goal read one manga a day might be a lot. Wow, that's an impressive goal. Yeah. Yeah, I've never read that much manga in Japanese, so my goal is to read at least five. At least five books as well. Could be more than five, but just at least that. I want to finish my first game in Japanese. Good goal. I'd like to finish my, my current book at the end of, by the end of June. What's your current book, Kelly and Kanji? And、uh, looking good. A lot of good goals. You can write those two in our Discord with that new quest there. My short term goal to finish Pokemon Shield ASAP, maybe the end of June, so I can get started stre、uh, streaming something else like Baten Ketos. My long term goal is. Is to、uh, every day either play a game in Japanese or read something in Japanese. Yeah, my goal too is to read Japanese every day, at least 15 minutes or more, probably more. So, yeah, good goals. Nice. Majo san ga toru. Looks good. There's a lot of stories about Majo, aren't there, in Japanese? Just saw that. Flying Witch manga yesterday that's also free on Amazon right now. Flying Witch.、Um, I started reading that last night too. I think I probably will read that manga because it looks good for learners. In fact, let me show you that one because it's so cool. I think we need to see it. All right, let's go back to the Discord. Someone want to link the Discord? This is a good time to do it.、Um, let's check the Summer Reading Club right here. And、uh, someone made their goal. My goal is reading 30 minutes a day, every day. Good goal. I'm going to upvote that. You can't see it at the bottom, but I just read it to you. So、uh, let's see. Ooh, someone's reading Inuyasha. Very cool. Yeah, I'm curious what everyone's reading today. You can post pictures of it here in the Summer Reading Club section. So check this out up here. 
So. I don't know why this is in hiragana, but it is. Flyingu Witchy. So Flying Witch, it's about a cat and a witch in a small town. Um, slice of Life, really good series. It's got Furigana. And right now, the first two volumes are free on Amazon Japan. You need to make it, you have to make an account, which can be kind of challenging. Uh, but if you can do that, this is a very good manga. It's worth, it's worth checking out. It could be a good first manga. If you're into cats, if you're into witches, it's a good one. This cat, unlike the Kiki cat, cannot talk, it seems. Anyway, check it out. Back to the game. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? Oh yeah, good goal here. I want to beat the visual novel game in Japanese. Very good goal. Tebby cited my goal is to finish a book on my bookshelf. Very cool. Is that Satoshi or is that Satoko no Nikki? Yeah, I don't know that one. Looks good. So this guy here, his goal is to warn us about impending star crashing into the world. Maybe? Or maybe he's trying to, like, destroy the world. I actually don't know what this guy's goal is. Onushi no haha. So this is a myth from your mom. So it's like a, a kind of like fairy tale, I thought, but apparently not. But once the world was destroyed by the Dark Lord, so Mao Niyote, so because of the Dark Lord, the world was destroyed. Ima, so now the world's been destroyed. At least fairly dis destroyed by the Dark Lord. And now this star seems to be falling. It must not have been a myth then. Ooh, nice. Match from the Space Station video game bar sent me here. Love the content. Glad you like it. And yeah, we, a lot of us, want to visit that bar someday. <laughs> we talked about it quite a bit yesterday. Got some good pictures of it too on the Discord. So good to see you. Have you been to the bar? How is that? bar in Osaka. There's a video game bar in Osaka. It's called the Space Station. You can play video games there for free. Of course, you probably want to get a drink though. I think I saw the drinks are around 600 yen starting out. Um, so yeah, I recommend if you're into that idea, playing free video games and getting drinks at a video game themed bar. You can get drinks like Hadoken, 1UP, different like video game themed drinks. I think Triforce. You can get a a shot called Triforce. If you're into that, go to that bar. <laughs> I am into that. I probably will go to that bar someday. If I'm in Osaka sometime, possibly. Uh, yeah, pretty much full Furigana in this game. And yeah, it is helpful, but... Someone mentioned before, you don't want to rely on Furigana forever. But, I mean, kids in Japan, they use Furigana. It's in games for a reason. Um, but just like kids in Japan, you don't want to rely on Furigana forever. I went to a smaller place, also in Osaka. Really? There's another place like that in Osaka, too. Interesting. What is the other place called? How many video game bars are there in Osaka? <laughs> Those bars are the best. We have a similar one in my country. Very cool. What is your favorite Japanese drink? Yeah, I have no idea. I'm not... I don't drink that much, so I don't really know. どうした人の話も聞かずぼーっとしようってしょうがないやつじゃのもう一度わしの話を聞くかそうでいいんか not listening to people's 
what people are saying and just zoning out. Hmm. I guess there's no helping people like you. Do you want to hear what I'm saying again? Uh... I don't think we need to hear what he said again. I think we were listening. I think we were kind of zoned out looking at that creature that they couldn't see, maybe. I think that's what was happening. Oh, so yeah, I think we heard it. We got kind of distracted by uh, things like Nose Song, things like Kostoko, things like Furigana, and things like uh, video game bars in Japan. But other than that, we were paying attention. Uh, do I live in Japan? I do not. I'm a Japanese teacher based in the U.S. What we do here, we learn Japanese in context from Japanese games. Um, I did live in Japan for two years teaching English through the JET program for two years in high school back some years ago. But now I do live in the U.S. and we teach Japanese through games here. So in a way, we transport here to Video Game Japan. You want to see a map of that? We got a map of that. So you can go to Japan. I recommend it. But you can also go to Japan in a different way, a different kind of Japan. This is Video Game Japan. And right now, we are here. Although maybe I should move that island more like here, because I think on this island now, in Japan, there is now a theme park. Dragon Quest World, or something like that. So I recommend go to that theme park. It's right here. Anyway, this is Video Game Japan. We started out in Xenoblade 2. And we learned Japanese as we went. And now we are here. And we will continue the journey, traveling through Video Game Japan. Game Japan. As we do, we will see more and more Japanese. At the same time, we will go through a different Japan. Japanese language Japan. As we level up in the game, we will level up in the language as well on this journey. If you're into that, you can follow, become a party member. This is what we do. Let's go back to Video Game Japan again. And by the way, here is Japan Japan, if you want to see it. I recommend going here too, but they are all good. And they are all ways of going to Japan, in a sense. What? We got a dragon! A dragon's been summoned to the real Japan this time. First time that's happened, I think. Let's summon this dragon to the video game Japan as well. Because we're going back there. Stop. Much like we got a dragon. Thank you very much for the sub. Let's go. Okay. You are the last dragon. People, if they want, they can summon dragons for free with Amazon Prime. One of the best things about Amazon, in my humble opinion. Um, let's go. The hype for learning Japanese on Twitch is real. Yep, Harry Potter in Japanese, we played it. We played Harry Potter in Japanese. I normally recommend playing games that are originally in Japanese, but sometimes the translation can be fun. We got a request to play that game, and we, we tried it. It was kind of fun. So, Ano Hoshi. We're talking about that star. Ano Hoshi. The star up there. Konomama. So, at this rate, Chijo ni Rakkasureba. If it falls to the earth at this rate, Samari mo Fuji de Sumumai. This city here will not be okay and I would think the world might not be okay if a star falls what the heck ah oh, really nice Philosopher's Stone is the game you were playing when I joined the quest really you were the one <laughs> we had like five viewers back then um sweet alright Let's go to the palace. Let's ask the king what's going on. Yeah, it's true. The fact is, I think a lot of people have found those streams on YouTube as well. But yeah, there are several people. The YouTube video is relatively popular. 
the Harry Potter one. Uh, we've been playing this game since 2019. Yeah, sounds about right. Yeah, it's been a while. It's been a while. We went a long kind of break. 2020, we didn't stream very much. And this is a very long game. <laughs> That's true too. Uh, yeah, we did play that. We found a emulated version on the PS1. And uh, one part was so hard with my bad controls on my keyboard that I could not pass, like, the minecart level. And actually, a different party member beat that part of the game. I was able to, like, send him the, the save file. He beat that part, which for me was fairly impossible. But uh, we did beat the game in Japanese. And it was fun. Very cool. Yep, we are all on this journey, like I always say. All party members are important, and even sometimes different party members can uh, step in and uh, help out sometimes. It was most apparent ever playing that game, Harry Potter, in Japanese. I still streamed and watched him do that part of the level and live commented on it because he was a streamer as well. Okay, we're going to talk to the king. Um, I will take a quick break before we do. And uh, then we'll be right back and we'll see if we can save the world from the star tumbling down to earth. So we will be right back after a short break. Itekimasu. And uh, remember, check out the Discord and uh, the quest today. What is your goal for summer reading? You can write that on the Discord, so check that out. Itekimasu. Japanese quest will be right back.
Teraima, Japanese quest is back. Let's go. Yeah, allergies can be intense in Japan. EverQuest, ooh, I see it. I loved EverQuest. Anyone else play EverQuest? EverQuest was a good game. It was so good for me, in fact, that it was addictive I had to stop playing it. And because of EverQuest, I kind of swore off all MMOs. It's just too addictive, I think, for me. Okay, so we're going to see the king. Uh, but first, we must check on how our tweet is doing. We tried earlier in stream to make the perfect tweet. Let's see how it's going. Ooh, we got eight bells, so pretty good. Pretty good. Let's see. 28 likes, 13 retweets. Pretty good. After a bit less than an hour. People have been liking it. Ooh, people have been liking the Summer Reading Club too. That's good. People have been liking the goals. That's good. People have been liking the new quest. This is, by the way, the new quest today. New quest, make a goal. Make it specific. What is your Japanese reading goal? You can say on the Discord or you can join the Twitch here too. Um, looking good. Let's go back to the game. What does the scouter say about his power level? Power level is going up. Let's find some more words though. Let's make it go more. Let's make it go up more. So far today, we've only powered up with the power of Hanauta. Nose song. It means humming. Let's see if we can make our power level go up even more. Ah, uh, yeah, I think there was a... Was there a new sound that I possibly pressed or something? Um, Zelda's discovery sound? Yeah, I can turn that off. I think. It must... It got turned on for some reason. Let's try again. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? Yeah, now it's just the power level. Oh uh, yeah, there was a Zelda sound that I used to use. When did I use that Zelda sound? It was for something. I forgot why I used that. Like, I think possibly like when we'd find like a new sentence and we like unlocked it, I would use that sound, I believe. So for example, we like would talk to this guy and I would like have chat write the sentence, then once we added it to our sentence list, then I would do this sound to unlock it. Let's see if it works. That's what we did. Have not done that so much recently. Let's see where we are. Here we go. So this is the prince, his son. So he's saying, stop trying to do something so dangerous. So father, you don't need to worry. I will figure out the mystery of that star and protect everyone in this town. Or at least to make them feel anshin. Make them feel safe, at ease. So what's the situation? Shinpai irimasen. You don't need to be worried. Shinpai is worry. So idu is to need. So irimasen, don't need to be worried. And then, uh, ano hoshi no nazo. So nazo is like a mystery. So the mystery of that star, I will figure it out. And remember any of these words we could add to our power level. Let's make this power level go up today. Anyone can add new words. Oh, that's right. It's like the forest is in the world. Ah, it's you. Akira. Um, thanks again for helping out my son before. 
ああなんとそそのご尊顔はああ、わっ。ガン。This is a word I've not really seen before. But it's not the word I, type of word I would normally look up because it's pretty obvious. Son means like respect. Gan means face. But、uh, let's look it up. Because it's fun when once in a while there's words that I. I have not really seen before. As a Japanese teacher, there are still a lot. I'm not a native speaker. And even if I was, there'd still be words I haven't seen before. So, your countenance, his, her, yeah, that's pretty much what I was thinking, like a kind of honorific, respectful term. Go son gun.、Uh, this is not really a word we probably need to add to our power level. Probably not a word that people say in everyday life anymore. But anyway, you get the idea. The first. Kanji means revered, valuable, precious. Gone, or Kao means face. Back to the game. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? Power level is going up. Sashibri dana, Samadi oyo. Ilunoa o imawashiki sayakuna o sota anohi. 四大国会議の日から十六年ぶりになるか。Yeah, I don't know where Jafar is, but I know where Buff Aladdin is. We've seen him in the game already. We talked a lot about him. He's in that,、uh, the Coliseum city. Exactly, exactly. Buff Aladdin.、Um, you had to be there. So, long time no see. They were both kings after all.、Um, yeah, ever since my kingdom was attacked and destroyed by monsters, it's been 16 years since that day we had the, the four country summit that they were both in. Lord, no! Did you want to be the key to you? Hmm. So I've heard everything. The one who brought the calamity to the world, the whole story about the devil child doing that, it was nonsense. Good word here. Might want to add that to our power level because all of that was. So let's see what that means. That whole story about the devil child bringing that. I cannot write properly in English. Nonsense. That's what I said. And yep, that story was complete nonsense. This is true, because we're actually the, you know, we're actually the main character of the game. If you want to see Buff Aladdin, this link should show you. He's definitely a kind of Buff Aladdin type. No, it's not a risky click. You can trust, you can trust Kelly and Kanji. She knows all about Buff Aladdin. So, Detarame nonsense, good new word, powered up to 3160 now. Look at the bottom right, power level going up. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? Delicadaru no uso minukoto mo dekizu, Sekai no hokai to you, Sayakuno jita yo mane de smata koto, Nedoka, o yurish kudasai. Oh, yurish kudasai. So please forgive me. So forgive me for what? All of that.、Uh, the fact that I did not see the, through the lie of the king of this other kingdom, Delicadaru. So. The word for lie, uso, to see through a lie, uso o minuku. So the fact that I couldn't see through that lie, 
um, and brought on all this chaos. Please forgive me. <laughs> so we saw, saw a recommendation from the comments here, but we got a different response here. Mo. It's all good. Raise your face. Yeah, that was all the doing of that the Dark Lord Mordigan. It's no one else's fault. ロードの。ロードの。そう、ロー、thank you very much. Yusha no Hoshi, the star of the hero that's falling down to earth. So if it falls down, we can't, there's no going back. So ano Hoshi Nitsuite, very useful grammar piece here. So about that star, Nitsuite means like about something. Very useful, very easy to use. So ano Hoshi Nitsuite, so about that star. Nanika Wakatenanoka. Do you know anything about that car? <laughs> that car? It's not a car, it's a star. I can't speak English. It's okay though. Do you know anything about that star? Yeah, imagine a giant car hurtling. To Earth. That'd be bad too, but no, it's a giant star. So according to our scholars in this country, um, they've been researching it, but Imano Tokoro, so for now, Nanimo Wakate Masen. Now they understand nothing. Tada Hitotsudake Kininarukotogarimasu. Huh. But there is one thing that we've noticed. So my son, Ferris, he's like, I think he's like Ferris Bueller, if you've seen that movie. You can watch a movie about him. Uh, ano Hoshi, so that star, there's this uh, red barrier around it. Akai Kekkai, a red, akai, red barrier. Um, and there seemed to be, like, lettering on it. Moji no yona mono. So, you, no yona, it seems like. So it seems like something like lettering carved into that barrier. Hmm, that's strange. Yusha no hoshi ni kekkai ga... And now he's just rephrasing everything the king said. What? There's a star and a barrier and there's lettering carved into it? Hmm. Kind of weird. I don't know about you, but like usually when I see a star and it has like a, a weird red barrier to it, usually there's not lettering on, on it. Usually it's just like a Smooth barrier, so it's rare to have that lettering. Hi, is already the Ojiwa Sakio do so no moji no yona mono shirabiru tame gaksha o tsurete bakura ba sakiu e mukaimashita. That's yes, my the prince, my son, he went ahead to uh, investigate that lettering. He brought along the scholars and went to that uh, the dunes. These dunes we went to before and fought this big scorpion. He went there. I'm thinking we're going to go there too. 
。ふむ。わしらも、何故勇者の星が落下を始めたのか、調べに行くぞ。So why don't we go to and find out why this star is falling? ロードの、バクラバサキューに行くのであれば。息子の様子を見てきてくれませんかどうもファーレスのことが心配で。So if you go there too to the dunes, can you、uh, check on my son? Because I'm, I'm worried about him. I'm worried about Ferris. Much like the movie Ferris Bueller's Day Off, we've seen that similar dynamic in the movie. Hmm. ありがとうございます。赤鳥を塞ぐ兵士には通行を許すように言いつけておきます。では、息子をよろしく頼みます。So thank you. The soldiers who are blocking the checkpoint, I will tell them to let you through. So please, help my son. Alright, let's do that. And、uh, as we go, let's try to find some new words to make our power level go up. Yeah, is this his day off? It seems like、uh, Ferris in this country, this is not his day off. It seems like it's his day to deal with the star falling. That could be like the sequel to Ferris Bueller's Day Off. The sequel could be Matthew McConaughey. His age now dealing with the star tumbling to Earth. Maybe Godzilla's involved. Because I believe Ferris Bueller was also involved in the Godzilla situation in another movie. Just an idea. Movie, movie producers who are listening, just an idea. We got a church here, might as well save. In case we have a star fall on us, that could be bad. Konnichiwa. You just spam the button to save, I believe. Inori to pray, we can save, looks good. Yosh. And if I recall correctly, the sand dunes I think are out here somewhere. Konnichiwa. He'll probably just tell us that. So I heard you're going to the dunes. Um, Looking for the prince. Yep. And、uh, not reading through all this, just kind of getting quick sense. So yeah. The main quick sense I wanted to get is which way? Nishi. West. Let's go west. And then north. Seems simple enough. There are monsters though, so be careful and be careful of the、uh, prince as well. So, west and north, let's look at our map and figure that out. Okay, west and north, yeah, it's up here, right? Probably this zone here, I'm thinking. So, let's go. Okay, so anyone new? What we do here, we learn Japanese from Japanese games, and right now we have a summer reading club for Japanese. If you want to, for the first time, try reading in Japanese, now is the time. Summer's a good time for reading. Bigger Roth RPG knows what I'm talking about. If you know what I'm talking about too, feel free to follow and、uh, answer this following question. If you want to do summer reading club,、uh, the main thing is just reading something even a little bit every day. What? Is everyone reading today? We talked about it 
yesterday, but today, what is everyone reading today? Right now, I'm reading Dragon Quest XI, and later, I think I'll read more of that manga that I talked about, Flying Witch. That manga was free on Amazon, the first two volumes, Amazon Japan, were free. So I think I'll be reading that later. Probably also I'll be reading The Solitary Castle in the Mirror, the book. Kagami no Kojo in Japanese. So what is everyone reading in Japanese? Ah, very cool. Yeah, I read that too. I read Mushoku Tensei. I read actually the web novel. So I read like 20 or so of those novels. And uh, yeah, it's, it's a pretty good one. And written, I think, in a really good way. Like a really kind of simple, nice prose. Very well written, in my opinion. And there's a reason for years and years, it was the number one novel on that giant website of web novels. I think it finally got passed by the reincarnated slime, but for many years, that was number one. Ah, very, very cool. Yeah, I read the first volume of that already this month in June. So I think that'll be the first book on my list, actually, for the Summer Reading Club. Once uh, at the end of the week, we'll talk about how we can kind of share your progress and show what you've read. My first on my list will be this one, To, to Your Eternity in English. In Japanese, Fumetsu no Anate. To You Who Is Immortal. I highly recommend that manga, by the way. I, I, I think it's still free on Amazon Japan. I think the first three issues are still free, but that may end very soon, I'm not sure. Uh, lots of words I don't know. Yeah, this is a good one. Kuma, Kuma, Kuma. Bea. Yeah, it's a very good one. Ooh, I should see that anime, too. I've not seen that anime. Yeah, check out the manga. Right now, the first three volumes are free on Amazon Japan. Check it out. You do you need, you need, you need to make an account for Amazon Japan, but otherwise... Those first three volumes are free. I think they're still free. At least they were last time I checked. Yesterday. I'm wrong. The first two volumes are free of that one. The first three volumes of, like, Attack on Titan are free. But yeah, making an account can be a bit of an enigma, though. It seems like you need a, a Japanese address. Sometimes people say you need a VPN. In my experience right now, I don't need a VPN. Just have that Japanese address. Oh, really? Yeah, I think you're right. I think they're free until today. So if you want to jump on that, this is probably your last chance now. I heard, yeah. They were free until June 10 in Japan. Is there anywhere you, you, can, like, you can see that info? Because I, I read that info somewhere, but I can't find it anywhere on Amazon. Yeah, I think just the Japanese address is needed. So VPN is needed for buying Kindle, book, Kindle books. Yeah, it was for me originally sometimes, but now I don't need the VPN. So it seems like it might change over time or maybe you need it at first? I don't really need I don't really know. Okay. Interesting. So I made an account on Amazon Japan before easily, no address, but didn't try reading. Okay, so you don't need the address to make it, but you might need it... You might need it to get Japanese Kindle books. I'm not sure exactly, but yeah, it's kind of a mystery because people, different people say different things. But in general, it's doable. You just might need to do some different things like make a Japanese address, for example, you might choose like a, a youth hostel in Japan that you could stay at, possibly, as an example. Let's quick save here. And uh, some people say you may need a VPN. So all things to try if it doesn't work. It definitely is doable though and highly recommended because it's just, it's just so easy to get Japanese books and manga, just one click, and often it's free. Like, the first two issues of that manga, To Your Eternity, free. First three issues of manga like Attack on Titan, Seven Deadly Sins. I saw two. The first three of now, Fairy Tale, are free, too. So if you want some free manga, do that. It might be the last day to do it. Although there always is some manga that's free. It just might not be such quality titles as right now. Here we go. <laughs> Wow, 
Wow, it seems like a big change in this prince. He seems much braver now. Before, he didn't want to do anything dangerous. But now... So, Kokoja, if we're here... Koko means here. Uh, moji ga... Miyaruwake naida. So, if we are here, we cannot see the lettering. On the barrier out there. So, we have to get closer and take a look. So going into the dunes here, it's dangerous. Even if it's you, the prince, I can't listen to your order. Too dangerous. So are you saying you can uh, decipher that lettering from here? Let's look at that word. Kaidoku. So doku is to read. Kai is kind of to like unlock or unravel. So can you decipher the lettering from here? Ah, uh, yeah, nice, awesome. Just snagged the first two volumes. Sweet. They are still free. Confirmed. Awesome. So yeah, make an Amazon account. Get those two volumes quick because it's not going to be free for much longer. If you're watching on YouTube later, it will not be free. Anymore. Sorry. Uh, but something else probably will be free, so check it out. Maybe something better, who knows. <laughs> Prince Chan. It's been a while. Ah, Sylvia! And everyone else! Hisashiburi. Long time no see. Ah, you're okay. Seems like almost everyone we know, at least, is okay since the world was destroyed, so the world wasn't destroyed that badly. Maybe it will be, though, if the star falls. <laughs> That's what I thought. So, Zuibun. So, you've really grown up a lot. To grow up, to grow. So, this prince has grown up a lot. Last time, he was scared of everything. And uh, let's see. So, we heard the situation from the king. You want to investigate that star. That's why you came here. Yeah, it's true. For the end of the world, people are doing pretty well. That reminds me of the song. It's the end of the world, and I... How's it go? <laughs> and I forget. I feel fine. But... Yeah, they are kind of playing end of the world bingo. You got this bingo board. Right? Falling star. Falling world tree. This is a tree, by the way. What else would be on the bingo board? Let's think of things that would be on the bingo board. So we got the falling star. We've got Dark Lord with many weird hairstyles. It's got six points of hairstyle. Uh, what else do we have? Um. Anyway, you can make a bingo. Hey, yep, as a king, this is my job. So, yep, he's not taking a day off. He's doing his job. Shigoto means job. So, shigoto shiteru. Yeah, I was thinking of the brigade, but I'm not sure if that would be on a bingo board normally. That is kind of unique to this game. The ocean froze. <laughs> true. A lot of disaster movies, that is true. Or like a giant tidal wave. Uh, demo. Minasan. Doshite kono bashi So why have you come here? I'm here for my job to save the world as the prince. Mm. So the reason we came here, our goal, is the same as yours. 
Very good word. We talked, this is the theme today, so let's super circle this. So make a goal. To make a goal. So make a goal. What is your goal for Japanese reading this summer? On the goal in the game, So our goal is the same as yours. Onaji, the same. Omai, you. Mokuteki, goal. So our goal is the same as yours. To uh, see what's going on with this star of the hero. Specifically, Chostal. Like kind of an investigation. <laughs> what? What? You're the hero of Dundersil. The general, Greg. To think that I meet you in a place like this. But you know my name? Of course. <laughs> so yeah, of course. Like, you are kind of the goal, the hero of all knights. Like, my goal is to join your unit. And that's what I've been gambaring for, working hard for all this time. Again, we see the word for kishi. Kishi no Hakogare. It's the one all knights kind of look up to is Greg here. Yeah, Greg kind of is the cooler version of the hero, you mean? It could be. So no kotoba Urishina. <laughs> so your words make me happy, but... So, その言葉, those words, so what you said, ga, so I'm happy, but... Even if you don't join my unit, if you protect the people, with that courage, Yuki, courage, Yuki ga areba, if you have courage, Omae wa Lippana Kishi, you're already a great knight. Do you think, yeah, maybe someday, the hero can be as cool as Greg? You can have a cool name like Greg, not just have no name. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm so happy getting praised by Greg, General Greg. So Prince, it looks like you're having trouble investigating the star here. Hmm. Yeah, it's true. The scholar here is, uh, scared. I can't decipher the letters myself, so I don't know what to do. In that case, I will decipher the ancient lettering. Ooh, nice. We finally have leveled up with the... I didn't know he had that ability, but apparently he does. If this was the game Xenoblade 2, you would need, like, ancient wisdom to be, like, level 4 or something. And we would need to, like, level it up before we could do this. Luckily, in this game, no such system. Thank God. That's one problem with Xenoblade 2. Eh? <laughs> Jisan, you can read ancient lettering? Arigato, thank you. We're saved. 
バクラバ砂丘の中心にある遺跡のあたりなら文字もよく見えると思う僕は先にそこに行ってるから So probably if you go to the center 中心 center So 中心にある So in the center From the ruins in the center イセキ ruins So the ruins in the center And then We can probably see the, the lettering well So 文字もよく見える So see it well 見える is to see よく Well よく見える To see well Let's go there I will go up ahead And go there よし行きましょう文字をお願いします。So please take care of the prince he's saying there. We will, as we've done before. And I think probably the ruins are here. This looks ruins y. We'll get attached to standing here. So I kind of want to quick check that tweet again. Let's see how our tweet is doing. We tried to make the perfect tweet earlier in stream. Let's see how we're doing. Got a couple more bells, so it seems like probably doesn't have a million retweets like we were hoping, but let's see where we are. So, again, the word for humming, anyone knew? The word for humming in Japanese is Hana Uta. Hana Nose, uta, song, so it means no song. Why is humming called no song in Japanese? Just try humming with your nose closed, you will find out quickly. So we're now up to 29 likes, 13 retweets. That's pretty good. Pretty good. People dig it. If you want to keep liking it, retweeting it, more people can learn some Japanese today. For the win. Looking good. Plus, to get today, new quest. If you want to re reply on the Discord or on Twitter here, or on comments right now, new quest, make a goal, make it specific. What is your Japanese reading goal this summer? Japanese Reading Club, if you click on that, you'll see the various posts about it. If you want to use that hashtag, feel free. We can uh, spread the word about Japanese Summer Reading Club that we're doing here. The quest yesterday, read Japanese every day this summer. If you want to accept that quest, just like that tweet. 37 people plus these seven seem to be doing that, so that's cool. Let's go back to the game. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? Scouter says power level is going up. Let's find some new words too. That's what we do. Do they want to fight or no? I can't tell if they're running away or trying to attack me. Ooh, they're made of metal. That's not good. Yosh. That's probably overkill, but oh well. We got a headless horseman over here. Let's say hello to him. Go to sleep. <laughs> Not bad.
So most monsters were in Dragon Quest 1, but I think this guy was not in Dragon Quest 1, this horseless guy. The robot guy we saw, though, was... Level up. Ooh, we can now ride this thing. I didn't even know that thing was sparkly. Not bad. Dash. To dash, you can see there. Non equal. What is that giant thing? Eh? Go what? Cheer! Sweet. Thank you very much for the bits. Arigato. I like your emote as well. The slime emote. Actually, we have that emote if someone ever gives like a thousand bits, I believe it unlocks the slime emote. So thank you very much for the bits. Uh, I thought this would be the... The ruins, maybe not. Should we keep going? Maybe it's deeper in. Might as well rest here, get our uh, magic back. Ah, uh, very cool. You've got the slimy mode from Shibuya Hako. Very cool. Yep, thank you very much for the bits. Um... Anyone new? I'm a Japanese teacher. What we do here, we learn Japanese from Japanese games. The good thing about it, you can learn Japanese in context, which often is not the case in things like textbooks. Also, video games are just kind of more fun than traditional ways of learning Japanese. So that's what we do. Just kind of make a place to relax, go on a journey. We need our evil horse, though. So I'm thinking we must have to go through here now. But I don't see the ruins on the map. Can we see that star anywhere, I wonder? We cannot. We got attacked by this guy. Hello. Exact. Konnichiwa. <laughs> this guy... scares me. Let's make him sleep. Guess he doesn't want to sleep. That's okay. Yep, it is good to have slime emotes. Lots of slimes in this game. Yeah, is that a cat emote too? We do have a cat emote that everyone can use if they're subscribed of Griffin Sensei here, our first party member on Japanese Quest. Also a Japanese teacher, by the way. There you can see it. Thank you, Screer. And is this the right spot? I feel like it's not. 
because no scene is happening. Where are these ruins? Can we see the star anywhere? See? I feel like we're below it. Maybe it's down there. That looks ruins -y. Wait a minute, though. Is that, like, through the cave? I think we may have failed. The Griffin hype is real. Griffin appreciates your emotes. As do I. The hype is real. Let's go. Okay, so where are these ruins? Uh... Must have been across the way. She cut off is rising. I see that comment from Nightbot. We're almost up to 16,000 party members on Twitch. I think we're almost up to 5,000 on YouTube. Who will be first at 9,000? At this rate, probably Twitch. We'll see. So the ruins must be somewhere here. I think the thing is right above us right now. So where are the ruins? We must have just missed it. So talk to the prince. Yeah, we gotta find the prince. And yeah, I don't I failed. I should have looked at that thing. It it said we had to meet him here. That would have been helpful. When in doubt, look at the adventure guide. Very helpful. He must be up here. What? Taihenda. Hey, hey, Prince. What are you doing sleeping? You came here to investigate the star, didn't you? こんなに大きな星を真下で見る機会なんてめったにあるもんじゃないから記念にさいやすごいみんなもやってみなよ。Wait, so he's actually okay. He's just laying on his back, enjoying the star, and uh, yeah, looking at the star from directly below. Will not get this chance again, so I thought might as well lay here. Everyone, give it a try. And unbox this. You make a, a strong point. We were known for a long time as the devil child. If we're riding that evil horse, it's true. People might think we are the devil child. Mm -hmm. So, Prince, you are uh, pretty brave, aren't you? So, I was told, and what's the deal with this, uh, these ruins? Just all of a sudden, in the middle of this uh, wasteland, kind of strange, don't you think? そう。じいちゃんのじいちゃんのそのまたじいちゃんの時代からあるらしいけど、詳しくは知らないな。So from a Jichan chain going way back, um, so my grandpa's grandpa's grandpa way back there, um, these ruins are from there, so I don't really know. <laughs> Looks like a normal day in Arizona to me. Yeah, do you have this guy in Arizona? 
作られた時は大切な役割があったのかもねなんだか五代のロマンを感じるわ So I bet when it was built, these ruins, it must have had some important purpose. Taisetsu na yakuari, yakuari purpose. Taisetsu, important.、Um, so yeah, I feel the romance of the ancient times. And by the way, this robot often doesn't mean like a romantic love, but more like a, a sense of adventure. うん、確かに星には何やら文字が書いてあるようじゃな。早速調査を始めるか。So it does look like there's some kind of lettering on the star, so I will start investigating. ん何<音声> Where's our horse? <笑>アキラさん、どこに行くんだ,だよ So where are you going? We still haven't finished the.、Uh... Investigation. So, yeah, if you're in Arizona and you see this guy directly below the sun, that's when you know you're in trouble. Great. Another character who speaks katakana. Always great fun. Can we break this down? Watashi ga. So, me. Mieru no ka. Can you see me? Much harder to read in katakana, as you can hopefully see here. Because normally we'd have kanji here, normally we'd have hiragana here. But everything's one kind of lettering, makes it very tricky. Luckily, there is still a space that helps a little bit. Imagine without that space, parsing it would be that much trickier. So, thank you, little creature, for at least using a space, even though you're limited to katakana. If anyone wants to know why it's katakana, you can do the katakana command. Kind of a robot type voice is probably the reason. Or somebody who doesn't really know language, or our language. So, can we see him? Or her, or it. Can we?、Um, we can vote. We can say, Hi, we can see you, or Yeah, we can't see you. Let's vote in chat. Sometimes we vote in chat. We haven't voted yet today, so let's vote. We can say, Hi, or Yeah, we got to vote for Yeah, we can't see you. Any other votes? We can see different words, ways katakana is used. Thanks for the katakana command there. We've got some more EA, we can't see you. <laughs> I kind of like the idea of trolling this creature, so yeah, I'm okay with EA. More EA, more EA. Yep, it seems most people are saying, no, we can't see you. Let's go with that. Even though saying it kind of proves we can see them, or at least hear them.、Um, let's go with EA. What? Please stop talking, Katakana. I cannot read your weird Katakana.、Um, Kiko made mo nakata na. So, yeah, I think he's saying, like, I didn't even need to ask, did I? It's obvious you could see me. So, t o d a y wa o m a i ga. Wow, this guy's got a weird voice. So, in this case, you are the Yusha, I think is what he's thinking. Yeah, exactly. Thank you for writing it the proper way. I appreciate that. Much easier to read this way. You see, this is how Japanese is much easier to read, even without spaces. When you've got kanji, when you've got kana, 
it's much easier if it's just katakana which by the way old games use just katakana must have been so hard to read yep that's true too <laughs> so you're talking by yourself. That's rare. What's going on? Noni? Oh no. Not good. Um... Yeah, it's so much harder to read in all katakana, but this part's pretty obvious. Wagamoto e kitare. So come to me. Um, what is coming to him? Sugisa Rishi? Sugisa Rishi. Tokyo. So the time for something. So now is the time. Come to me. And I'm guessing this might be like the name of the star or something. Come to me. Anyway, the star is coming in. Let's go. What? what? What's happening? Look, the star. Not good. You see, I told you, if this happens in Arizona with that little guy, <laughs> bad situation. What? The star is falling. Yabai yeah, is right. Whoa. What? Nani? Rosama! This place is dangerous. Let's quick. Let's get out of here. New party member. Let's get them out of here too. Let's go quick. Wait, just a little more. Then I can read the letters. Whoa. Not sure what that means. Fa? Fa? Rosama! Mo Genkai this! Sa! Hayaku Kochire! Mo Genkai des Genkai is the limit. We're at the limit. Quick, let's go. Over here. No need. What what's happening now? Now, the world will be mine. Was that the Dark Lord's sword? The star disappeared. あの星は本当に勇者の星だったのか。それにあの剣を持った魔物は一体。Ah, uh, yeah, I'm not sure about that voice actor. I see in chat. Um, was that really the hero's star? 
And what was that monster that had that sword? What are you saying, Greg? It's a Kyuseishu! Kyuseishu! Kyuseishu has saved Samadhi! So what are you saying, Greg? They are clearly our savior. The savior has saved our city of Samadhi. Now everyone in Samadhi can relax. Things are safe. So I'll go back to the city. If you've got anything to talk to me about, you can meet me in the palace. <laughs> that was odd. Is the prince under the control of the Dark Lord? I guess we'll find out. I don't know. Um... Looks like Morgan and Kiryu. Really? Okay, so Kiryu. Who is Kiryu? What is Kiryu from? I'm not sure if I know that. So Morgan and Kiryu are the same voice actor. Ah, from Yakuza Zero. Okay, okay, that makes sense. So it disappeared, that star, but in ancient writing carved onto it was Nizu Zerufa. But what in the world does that mean? I agree with him. What does that mean? Very buff, dumb Yakuza guy, and also, apparently, the Dark Lord. Morgan. それじゃあ、サマディの王様ちゃんにニズゼルファーって言葉に心当たりがないか聞いてみましょう。何かわかるかもしれないわ。Hmm. Well, let's go and ask the king, see if he knows about what that word might mean. Well, let's go and ask the king, see if he knows about what that word might mean. Sounds good to me. Nani. Oh no, he's sad now. Oh no. Hmm. Not sure if that's good or bad. New party member, Yokoso. Japanese customer. Welcome. The journey has been long and the journey continues. Learning Japanese from Japanese games. I'm a Japanese teacher, that's what we do. It's fairly fun, that's why we're still doing it. In general, my opinion is the best way to learn a language is to have a journey using that language and just get used to it. It's just more fun that way than just like using a textbook. So that's what we do, we're on a journey. A field trip, you might say, through Japanese games, learning language and context as we go. I can't believe that star was destroyed right before it hit the Earth. Something strange. Yeah, something strange must happen. We got a dragon! Let's go! Ooh, King Marnie. Or Manry. Thank you for gifting the sub. Thank you very much. Do appreciate it. The hype is real. Hontoni. Arigato. Okay. Um, so what happened? This uh, star of the hero, Yusha no Shiga. Chijo, the ground, you can see the ground here, 
So Chijo ni Ochiru. Sunzen ni. So right before it fell down. This Sunzen means like right before it fell to the ground. Luckily, it was destroyed. Kawaru to be destroyed. I can't believe it was destroyed. Something must have happened. So you were in those rock um, ruins, weren't you? Did you see something? Would you tell me what you saw? Nandeste? Someone destroyed it or cut the star? Yep. Jodan desu. You must be you must be joking. Jodan is joke. Like to think that star could be cut? There's no way that could happen. Yeah, well it did. I'm thinking this guy will just say the prince went back. Yep, the prince went back to the castle to tell the king what happened. Let's go back there too. I'm kind of curious, what is this purple thing here? I don't even know what a purple thing is. Why is there a purple thing there? Could it be one of those like little guys? No. Nani. What is purple? Ah, purple means quest. Yeah, we've been giving quests recently, but in the game we've been not doing quests because uh, we're still in Act 2 and we've already taken like 160 hours in this game. So yeah, let's not do the quests for now. We're still in Act 2 on Boxers. This game's kind of long, especially when you teach Japanese through it. But that's a good thing, too. I recommend if you're learning Japanese, find a book series. Find a long game. Find something long. Because the further you go in it, it gets easier and easier. By the end, you're pretty used to the language, or at least playing the game or reading the book. And a big part of it is just getting used to it. The process of reading. Or the process of playing the game. I think we may have gotten like a new recipe. Let's check that quick too. See if we could do some uh, blacksmithing. Just check our new stuff at least. So this looks like it's really nice stuff for Serena. Let's see if we can make it. Ooh, I'm guessing we probably don't even have the skill to make this thing. Sozai ga tarimasen. Don't have enough stuff either. Let's try saving then. Uh, yeah, that's a good question. You know, it's kind of up to you and how motivated you are to play games in Japanese. For example, yesterday I was I followed or I rated a streamer. They said when they started playing games in Japanese, they played a visual novel. They only had like 5% comprehension. They knew almost no Japanese, but they wanted to play so much it still worked and now their Japanese is fluent. They live in Japan. They have really great Japanese. Um so it kind of depends on how motivated you are. Like if you understand 5%, that's more than 0. But uh, I would agree with Unboxious, though, in general, at least around N4 level, makes the games more doable. For books, people often say an N3 level, and for games to make it easier, N3 level 2 might be more the zone of where it's comfortable. But if it's... I started playing more like an N5 level, so more of an, a beginner level is when I started. And so I had probably not 5%, but probably I had like, I don't know, 20% understanding when I started. And I still had fun. So I just play a game I already knew, like Final Fantasy X, and I'd start to look things up, start to get used to things, so it, it kind of depends on you. But you could just try it. Some games you can just change the language, so start anytime. But it kind of gets more fun and easier 
every day the more you play. So I'd say give it a shot, just and just see. Like in my opinion, there's just something about playing games in Japanese that's so fun intrinsically for me. Like to play an original Japanese game in Japanese, even if I understand none of it. I don't know, to me it's fun. That's just me. I think even with like 1% understanding, yeah. it would be fun. And you just like build from there, 1%. Maybe in a week I'm 2%, maybe another week I'm 3%, maybe another week 4%. It keeps going up, it keeps getting easier. So I think that's the key. But really to make it comfortable, N3. Is probably roughly where it's more comfortable. Okay. Going back to this country here, back to the kingdom. You can see the volcano. We're going there next. I think to forge the hero sword. Right now we need the hammer to use to forge it. In fact, that word hammer we talked about today, let's uh, let's maybe power up with the power of hammer. Let's look up the word hammer in Japanese. So, Kanazuchi, hammer. But this one we haven't seen in the game, so let's uh, do the one we've seen in the game. Katakana, Hanma, common word marked here. Let's uh, copy it, add that to our power level to see if we learned it already. We have not. Now power up with the power of hammer. 31, 61. Let's go. Power level going up. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? Power level is now going up. Yeah, Kelly, depending on what you're reading, you can see that a lot. Since you played some games and things using hammers, you probably have it a lot. Yeah, I think the other one we had already, the other word for hammer. On boxes, I think. That sounds right to me. Check out this country, quite the wall here. I'm thinking today we can end the stream here. Looks like a good place. And uh, one more time, let's see how our tweet is doing. Ooh, we got some more bells. Check it out, 32 likes, 13 retweets. Pretty good, pretty good. Maybe not the perfect tweet ever, but pretty good. Check it out. If you like it, like it. If you really like it, retweet it. But basically, try it. Try humming with your nose closed. Doesn't work very well. Why? Because in Japanese, humming, the word for humming is hanauta, humming. Nose song. Um, also today, check out the new yeah, go down to the bottom, check out the new quest. You can see it. Make a goal, make it specific. What is your reading goal this summer for reading Japanese? Find the Discord. If someone want to share the Discord in chat, you can find it here. Um, ooh, so Kelly has a goal here. Journeyman has a goal here. I've been reading through quite slowly. Great book for N3, N2 level. Click on that. Looks like a good book. This one I don't think I know. Goju Arashi. Like 50 storms, I'll click on that later. And then uh, Kelly, my goal is to finish the first volume of Majo San Ga Toru. So another series about witches, that looks good. So other people, write what you're reading, what is your goal? It could be how often to read, who graded readers too. Great link here, thank you Kelly. So check that out, join the Discord, check out this new channel. Quests Summer Reading Club right there. In general, you can make general comments too. So anyone who joins, welcome. There's lots of other channels too for things like reading, for things like videos, for things like games. Feel free to share in all of them. Ooh, yeah, this Terrace House clip was shared by Kelly. Thanks for sharing that. So we'll end the stream there. Ja, matane. That's a Rikai Kun is that tool. It's a Google Chrome plugin. Recommended. 
Some people like Yomi Chan even better, but for this format, Rikai Kun works pretty well. So I will say, Ja! Matane, see you next time. Japanese Quest will continue tomorrow at the same time. Utsukare, Ja! Matane, see you next time. It's been a fun stream, so everyone, see you next time. Ja! Matane, let's see who we should uh, raid to. We always raid someone. Spread the hype for learning Japanese all around Twitch. Let's see who's out there. Let's go to, uh... Let's find who's streaming right now. There must be someone. Ooh, we see, uh... Someone. Really? Game Grammar, I'm surprised. They are streaming Duolingo. Game Grammar, I'm surprised. Is it any good? Duol... I cannot believe that Game Grammar is streaming Duolingo, but I'm curious. Is it any good? Let's uh, host them and let's find out. Is Duolingo any good? You can find out from Game Grammar. Um, surprising that they're doing Duolingo. But let's check it out. Let's uh, raid them and see, is Duolingo any good? They're a Japanese teacher, so they can help us find out. I actually don't know. People say it's getting better. Originally, people said it was not good. Let's see if it's any good now. So let's start the raid. Ja, matane. Japanese quest will continue.